and this time we have Torva, Torva Messerem 88. I probably got that wrong, but that's uh, okay, Torva. Um, coming up against the Blue Moon. Big fan of this weapon, big fan. And, oh, Hollows are moving over. Are you at the top of the ladder? You are? Okay. Hopefully you won't attack me. Perfect. Engraved gauntlets there, that's always a bit uh, a bit annoying with the that hide, hide spear. Is it hide or hide or hader, hider? I don't know, anyway, it's the electric spear that those knights drop. Um, okay, and bro, some sort of low armour, low armour build, so it's probably going to be quite fast. Um, so let's see. Obviously he's got the range, so I want to try getting in close. Yep, rolled through both those. Animation cancelled as well. Just try and fish for a backstab, but it didn't happen. And he caught me uh, on the roll there. So this guy, uh, yeah, this guy's decent. Let's see if I can, uh, well, let's see if I can bait him into uh, let's whiff that. And oh yeah, okay, <laughs> okay. Everyone loves to try and punish the shield break, but okay. So that uh, didn't do as much as I was hoping. It just did a bit over half. Tried to get the wake up shield break. He, uh, he dropped his shield just in time, but only caught him once. Usually I can catch people twice with that. Stun locked them into two hits, that was a bit annoying. Oh, and now he wants to parry back. He seems a bit, yeah. He wants to parry back there. He tried to reaction parry. But I can shield break, go for the one-two, and... Again, it didn't connect with the second one, which is slightly annoying. I thought I could have finished it there, but... So he's turtling now. Uh, backing up. I just wonder whether he wants to shield break. But I'll try a little combo on him there. <laughs> oh, he did want it. He wanted the parry. But I predicted that coming, so in between the uh, in between the R's, I did a little shield break to stun him, and that was uh, that's GG. Thank you, Torva. Thanks for that. It was a good one. <laughs>